Hi, I'm Kelly, and I wanted to tell you a little bit about our Libby bag. Um, the Libby bag was named after my friend Libby. She was the first person who wore the bag and tested it out for us um, for about nine months, and so we decided to name it after her. Um, the reason we came up with the Libby bag is because we wanted a bag um, that we could use when we were traveling as a carry-on, or a bag that would carry our laptop, our laptop and our gear, and so many things in between. Um, and that's where the Libby bag came from. I'm going to tell you a little bit about it. I'll start on the outside of it and work my way to the inside. Um, with all of our bags, we want them to be able to function well, um, whether you're a professional photographer or a mom with a camera or a student or if you're just a person who likes a bag that keeps you very organized, um, we want our bags to be applicable to you. So um, we feel like we have done that really well with the Libby bag. Um, on, the, on the front, you'll find one big pocket, as you can see. Um, I, in this bag, when I carry it, um, I'm usually carrying it as a travel bag. So I keep my airplane tickets, um, my uh, keys, my wallet, my lip gloss, things like that. Um, and you have two zipper pockets up here. Gum, mints, any other little thing that you need to carry. Turn it to the back. We have a large zipper pocket on the back. And I actually had already put my um, iPad in here, so it will fit your iPad comfortably. The Libby bag does come with um, two handles. Um, it's very comfortable, as you can see. Wear it over your shoulder. And as all of our bags do, this one comes with a long adjustable messenger strap so that if you do want to wear it crossbody you can. It is removable. Alright, so let's move to the fun part, the inside. Um, now the Libby bag is our first women's bag that can carry a laptop. I actually don't even own a laptop right now so I wanted to show you the way that I use it. Um, you can look on the details page of the Libby and you can see different configurations on the inside of the bag and see how you can carry your laptop and it will, it will carry up to a 17 inch um, laptop. If you do have a huge PC, it might be a little bit snug, um, but 17-inch uh, max, no problem, fit in there very comfortably. Um, so I'm going to show you how I use the bag. Um, if you can see the inside, um, this bag comes with one large, long laptop divider, um, and it comes with three large, or I guess I could call them medium-sized dividers. Um, and then two small dividers. Now what I have done, rather than use the large divider that goes all the way across for, for a laptop and put it snug up against the side of the bag, I put it in the middle of the bag to, to make my bag have two sections. Um, so I'll have this section to use and then I use the other side, if you can see, I'm going to use that side for my gear. Alright, so what I'm going to fit in the bag today is my camera with a lens attached. This is a um, pro body. It's um, the, a 4x6 body, not a 6x6 body, although the bag can accommodate a 6x6 body as well. Um, so here I have the lens attached. I'm going to figure out where I want to put it in here. Okay, I have a 70 to 200. Um, I believe this is about an 8 inch lens, and the Libby will fit up to a probably a 10 inch lens, so you don't have any problems with that. Okay, I have my 80 millimeter. Now I'm going to use this last section that I have made for my flashes. Actually, I think I'm just going to put one flash. I'm going to put my pocket wizards in here. You can see so far how I've used that half for my gear. And there are little grooves left, little nooks in there. If you do want to fit every bit of gear you can, you could probably fit other little things in there, but um, this is what I'm doing for today. The other side I'm going to use as my travel side. So um, I have the accessory pouch, which actually we do sell on the website. Um, and I use it for using for everything. I use them as my uh, carry-on to carry on my travel things with me, my makeup and things like that. Put that in there. I'm also going to have a change of clothes.
as well as a straightener. Okay. And you can fit things in here so many different ways. Alright, so you see the inside of the Libby bag. Oh, I forgot to, to tell you, with the small dividers, um, I did put one on here. I actually laid it flat and attached it to this inside of the bag and made a little pocket. Um, so you can use the little dividers or any dividers for that matter, attach it to the wall of the bag and make a pocket if you want interior pockets for your bag. Um, many people have said, what is this divider for? Um, you can get creative and use it however you want to use it, um, but I, we made it so that if you do, um, if you're traveling and you have your gear in here and you want to use the remaining space at the top of the bag, you can put it over your gear. And so if you want to do put gear all on the bottom, put this on top of it and put um, like your clothes and things like that on top of that is just to protect your gear while you're traveling. All right, so that's the Libby bag. It is all zipped up. We have all that gear in it. I also have the iPad in the back, and so let me show you how that is. Let me zip these pockets. So it's very nice. Uh, of course, if you put 50 pounds of gear and things in the back, it will get heavy, so um, just be careful that you're not um, going to weigh yourself down too much, or you can wear it messenger style, and this is what I travel with. Um, it's just a great bag, great looking bag, very functional. Um, as with all of our bags, um, they are this bag is made out of a high quality man-made material, um, so it is water resistant. Um, and I think that is all for now. So um, if you have any other questions, feel free to email us from our website, or you can look at the other photos on the details page of the Libby to see the different configurations we've done for the inside. Thank you so much, and I hope this helped you decide what bag works best for you. Have a great day.